And hello and welcome everyone, I'm Insane and this is City Skylines once again. Oh, this. You didn't see the number on the top right if it actually got recorded in. Hmm. So, let's continue. We were on the progress of looking at these crafts, so let's look at the crafts. Mostly adults, seniors, mostly families. Is this all of the three that are needed? That's good. And actually, one thing I was wondering is if you delete some of the cemeteries, what will happen? <laughs> I mean... Uh, what did I have in my mind? I can't remember, actually. But, you know, well, I mean, if you remove them, will they just dump all of the bodies away or something? I'm just... Oh well. That's the hashtag food for your thoughts or something. Anyway, let's. We upgraded those so we get some more of the land value thing and. Also, so we get mm, the noise pollution down even more. Because that is important, I think. Okay. Well. Badoom! Someone died. And yes, we still have this problem of people just not getting to work, but I guess that will work itself out once we get more people in. These are already done like this. So now it's worth just trying to find all of these roads that are not upgraded. How do you are the landfills full again? What's happening in here? Uh, they are empty, so let's actually let them do their job again. Hopefully it is... Yeah, I mean they are all, almost full all the time, so... It's not that efficient to... To... Keep them going. I mean, trying to empty them somehow, but they just keep on waiting for garbage. How about the energy side? Yeah, we need more energy, so well, let's actually... We shall make more of these incinerators. And we can make three of them, so... That's good. This should pump up the power output quite well. Yeah, you are advertising the same thing all the time. So now they are getting some of the garbage in. From somewhere, I don't know where, but they are. I don't know what's the good ratio for this, but at least it's working for now. These do have a higher upkeep, but I guess it's worth it because of the... I mean, we don't need to worry about landfills then. And we get more of seagulls. Seagulls are fun, especially when they attack you and then after that they poop on your face. What is this? This is the university. Okay, we don't need that. This stuff is good. How about... Um, because we had this pump down a bit, so... Let's actually pump all of you way back up. How much will that affect anything? At least it, I think it gave us more power output, so that's good. 
And now we have more of garbage trucks also, so we get more action in the city. Follow my scientific station build at the bottom of the sea, famous... what? Famous field director among the founders. <laughs> okay. I don't know what's the reference for that, but that's cool. So, we need to expand. Let's... First of all, let's just zone all of the neat stuff that we have planned for you. And the citizens. Like this. Let's build some of the offices in here. Like this. You need water. Am I... Oh, I'm starting to run out of it. Yes, so... Let's build the intake hose. It needs to be connected. Like so. Then we can also create an output here, so we get more of the poop water out, like so. So now we have all of them up, up and running. And then let's look at the pollution. No. Oh, it's in the pollution tab. There we go. Oh yeah, that poop water. Go swimming there. It's going to be fun. Relax the water. Do we know it's not open yet? Now it's at 18,000, so we will make that at that point. And then, metro station. I was thinking of maybe making a metro station like, station like this. And then maybe a ne next one on, on the other side. And there comes the music. Yeah. So. Metro in here. I wonder how many of these I actually need. The next one in here, then. Well, we'll see it once we actually start building the line, I guess. So every second. But that means I actually bunked it up. Maybe we'll do one in here. And then one in. It's gonna be a bit off the line, but one in here. So it goes like that. And hopefully it reaches all of the oil plants that are down there. So let's build the tunnels. Oh, apparently you can actually even go outside. I mean, underground. You can... Er, oh yes, you can do them. You can curve them. So let's try to curve them. Yes, okay, cool. What happened in there? So it's a passing line. No, not. That's not going to happen. So then we get the line to end there. I guess in this game they can actually go like back and forth. Let's try. I mean, in cities in motion, I think they couldn't do this. So you had to make the loop at the end. So I didn't notice how large the... Yeah, it's just enough. Yeah, you can make it like this, so that's good. So now, everyone gets to use the... Metro.
So the line is, I guess it's complete now. I guess. No? Yes? <laughs> I don't know. Oh yes, there we go. Two people per week. So let's actually see it. Uh, I can click that, okay. Hmm. Is there an expense? Uh, what's this? Oh. So let's, yeah, we have 700 of expense. So I think the buses were paying themselves back already. So hopefully the tram will do the same. Not the tram, but the metro. So 10. At least once we sort of keep on continuing this line. So we do all the way down here and then continue it here also. Oh, whoa, what's happening here? What is going on? Am I really out of power? Oh, yeah, why? How? Is it because of this? Seven. Nine, eight, eight. So maybe, since they are starting to, I mean, they are not running at full speed at all. So I guess we will just empty at least this one and this one as well. So they will dump all of the stuff in those. Yeah, let's dump all of them. So we get more poop in these. Okay. Let's see. So these are full. No, that's not kind of full, but... It's okay. Uh, let's not fill you up anymore. I mean, empty you. It has to be safe, so someone is actually gathering the stuff. And I mean, it will be pretty cool if. It looks like really cool if. No sort of stuff to pick up the dead. Ooh. Ooh, I don't know. <laughs> Is it a problem? I guess it's starting to become a problem. Is this full? Almost, but not yet. But this one. No, there's enough. Oh, but it's probably because, yeah, all of the hearses are in use. So we probably should make a new one anyway. A new cemetery. On there. That's quite a scenic place for people to sleep. Mm -hmm. And then... First of all, if we do expand these... Maybe we should. And we probably actually have to also expand the roads. Maybe we should also do that. Well, let's expand. Expand, expand, expand. Like so. So now we can also expand that. And we can expand to that side later. So I'll remove. I'll not remove, but let's make more work. Okay, like so. Then we can, or we should, at least upgrade this side to become world like this. This we can do actually for now. Okay, and then we finish upgrading, and we do it 
things and draw it like that. This will continue like this. Then I'll make more of one road wide thing is okay. Then we'll have to figure out how to be and how we will connect these two. I guess that's good. Oh well. I mean, yeah. And actually, now that we are with in this business of working out the traffic, well, a bit, not a lot, but still, we should maybe edit edit this line. So destroy those. And then we'll make it from here. Our sales, like so, and we will probably, yeah, we should also do this one and ten at some point, or maybe even now, or not. Now we don't need to. Where do you go, actually? Yeah, you just do a loop to loop. So let's. We decide. Okay. I'm doing this simply because the <sighs> I mean having this one way system is kind of not efficient. I'm not one way but just one lane. <laughs> They're so pretty ugly, but that's what you have to live with. Let's actually see if we can just upgrade this, so... Yeah, we can. Okay, that's good. Because it makes the life at least somewhat easier. Then maybe if we just remove this outside road, we can actually expand the, this one also. Yeah, we should have actually done the same thing for all of them. Oh well. <laughs> Wrong. Wrong thing, but I guess that's okay. We would have I mean we do, we would have to do that anyway at some point. So there we go with that one. They're not co quite Picasso worthy, but not because of Picasso worthy, but <sighs> Oh well. They do their jobs. Wow. Insane was here. Anyway, we can now demolish all of these. Well, two of them. And then we can do the small road in the middle here. Like so. Then once we get some buildings in here we can remove some of the power lines so we get more of space for people and pause so because it's kind of low quality land we're actually going to make some so large buildings Well, I mean, why do you build so many, many factories then if you don't get the workers for them? And now we are starting to run into this problem that I was kind of afraid of. The lines are just getting stuck. Because all of these guys want to go to the same place. So maybe next time 
I mean, at the next moment, we should maybe buy this lab area. Yeah, we have to. Because then we can buy, I mean, expand. Do we have the money actually for it? How much does it cost? I guess it always doubles the... No, it doesn't actually. Yeah, I, I think it still does. So, <clears throat> if we buy this... No water. Yeah, of course not. But yeah, if we buy this... Then we can do the lines for tiles. Yes, so... And look at how much oil we have in here, so maybe we'll purchase this. Yeah, now it's doubled again. Okay. So that's the way how they limit the buying speed. So this helps. We most likely... Is this oil? It is oil. Hmm. When I was thinking, maybe... Just maybe, we will actually remove all of these, change them into homes and stuff like that, and then make new industrial area in there. Let's actually zone this already. So we get more oil. Take the proper. Ooh, okay, so we have some water issues. Oh, yes, we do. Let's build a water line. It reaches everyone. Good. So that's that. I think. Yes. So back to zoning. Oh, we are also running out of. No, we are not. What's the problem? And we are again running out of power, so... What's this one? It's a hydro, but mm, it's the... It's the issue of... I mean, we can't actually do it on this river. If we want to have the boats. If we want to ha have the boats, we have to do it in here. Yeah, now we are actually really running out of the power. Let's see, how much that was... Ah, oh, it's there. Ah, this is 18, this is 20. We have to, we really have to get that zone though. Oh well, let's build more of you. <laughs> there we go. How much are you empty? Yes. These also should have so that if they are empty, they should automatically just finish emptying them. You can empty yourself. You can empty yourself. And what is happening here? They're trying to get empty. What? Yeah. Abandoned homes, that's too bad. Oh, it's a fire! But they get to. Let's see. Yep, just in time. Just in time. And next. Well. Let's build some more. I mean, let some more people in. Like so. And let's also put that one already. So that next time, I mean, we can keep on doing that while we zone this place even more. Like this. And then we have to edit this way, this place completely. We have the money for it, so how do we get so much money actually? <laughs> it's funny how in the first uh, one or two episodes we were like, 
Oh, how will we keep this in positive? And now it's completely like irrelevant. I mean, the money is just who cares? We could probably even get the taxes lower to get the people in, but maybe not. Anyway, I'm insane. I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye.